So, as she's about to go and start traveling, I look up and I wonder, no way. It couldn't be that simple. That stupid mining sign! Mines? This is interesting. <laughs> it would be quite possible for someone to redirect the train towards the mines. Huh. Examine the side railway branch at Evesham. <coughs> so apparently there's something we've missed from there as well, so we'll go back there. Because there it's just showed us it's completed. So I've obviously missed something of that side branch. What did I miss here? How innocuous is it innocuous is gonna be, eh? <clears throat> Search just spread everywhere. Is there something in here? This road should ah. lead to the town of Evesham. Does that mean the whole thing's completed? Don't like leaving clues unfound. As <sighs> it would be nice to crouch. Oh. A good careful look. Okay, so anything I'm gonna miss. Hmm. Building. No, not the switch. Examine the mines, examine the side railway branch at Evesham. <clears throat> Isn't that what we did? So, what the hell am I missing? Huh. That's peculiar as hell. Okay. <laughs> I'm lost. Okay. <clears throat> Salmon the side branch leads the quarry at the station between Cheshire. And Evesham, okay. <coughs> Alright. Let's go to... 
Go to the beach. Kind of some clue I haven't I found there, but... It's... Sometimes they're in the weirdest spots, and... Yeah. Here we are at the beach that is located near the quarry and Doncaster Station. It doesn't look like a very good place to rest. These traces were made by a carriage. Look. The distance between the tracks is about six feet, seven inches. Oh, uh, yeah. The vehicle would have been heavy, as these tracks are quite deep. The vehicle would have been... The vehicle pressed this stone into the ground. It would have been quite heavy. Yeah. These traces are relatively fresh and were made by a large truck loaded with materials. The traces found at the disassembled shed near Evesham and at the lake were from the same vehicle. So look around. An advertisement for lake cruises. Okay, so I'm guessing that's how they got the the prototype out of there, quite possibly. An abandoned gypsy caravan. This place was abandoned fairly recently. Observing the coastline and the moored boats, we are able to see that the lake's water level dropped. The lake has flooded the quarry. The dam was probably breached. Sensible conclusion. Last zap, la zap, las zapas. A label with the name Las Zarpas. Hmm. Okay, that's completed. Let's try and put a few, um... No, that's deductions. I reckon, at this point, that... Yeah, Miss Doncaster, I reckon that's he... He's being bribed. I reckon that's the case. This one... Field despite being unsure the station master sent the report. And never passed through Chesterfield. The station master was drunk in this since our apple. He could have sent the report without witnessing the train. Yep, I think that is quite possibly the case. Hmm. Chileans were left. Directors of the Chilean Bacazas Company. Uh, company were left were intentionally left on the train. Troll removed all passengers train except the Chileans. It was just coincidence train overlooked them. No, I think that was intentional. At this point, it looks very suspect to me. <clears throat> hmm. A lot of easy money thanks to the insurance. Fraudulent. Lost machine says us. If you know he planned his fraud, lost files. Could not cover the total. Uh. Hmm. 
I think at the moment he's possibly a victim, but that could change. Yeah, we're only seeing a lot of facts. So at least I've got draw conclusions I can. Okay. Go to Doncaster. I don't suppose any proud end of the Mexican no we can hmm. Oh I see. Didn't even notice this before. This railway branch should lead to the quarry. Let us take a look. The rail is rusted and looks old, but the railway is still usable. It would seem. Oh yeah, someone's moved the tracks. The railway ends here. Right, so investigate that, so what? <laughs> the rails may have to do a switch. The switch is rusted, but Aha. Uh -huh. Transport, flooded quarry. Okay. Could be train could have been sunk in the flooded quarry. A Doncaster train cannot be sunk in the flood because the old worry that leads to some rail missing rails. Hmm. Dunno. Need the mines. Mines side branch at Evesham. Don't know what the hell I'm supposed to find there. Let's go to the mines then. Because that'll answer a few more questions for us. Here are the mines homes. They appear to be abandoned. Yes, appear is the correct wording here. The distance between the tracks is about four feet eight inches a lightly loaded vehicle came this way there is a wooden beam lying on the rails a small vehicle with wooden beams 
went down this way. Hmm. So, gonna have to investigate all this, are we? Right. And that wreckage, okay. This mine has completely collapsed, Holmes. It is curious, but to be truthful, I am not entirely surprised. It's difficult to follow you, Holmes. Someone removed these screws, most probably to take down the rails. Yeah. A few feet of the rails have been dismantled. To get the illusion. Ah. Hmm. This is an unusual kind of paper, stiff and dry. It was used for a specific purpose. Let us look inside. Okay. Sawdust. I am almost certain it is a... Watson, could you assist, please? Do you have your pistol? Good. Fire at this package. Okay. Let's try and be a bit accurate, shall we? Huh. Dynamite. Yeah. Lines of blasted. Railway to the old railway to the quarry. Okay. But this one, okay. Concealment he used to hide the train down, which used after the train was moved inside down to collapse with dynamite. Somebody wanted to close them intentionally. Hmm, the other one could be sunk, cannot be sunk. Let's have a little look around first. This is the cabin for the mine's security person. Okay, well, didn't mean to go the get it inside there. Oh. This box must be the safe. Let's open it. Right. Okay, a bit more of a complex summer, that's fine. Can't be that one. Okay, so... It means it speed this one here. Let's this one up so this one matches.
Okay, never mind. This no no, <laughs> just up a tad just so we can see. Okay. So that would then mean that this one would need to line up. Oh, okay, I see what's going on here. Okay, so this needs to... Just have... Oh, I see. oh yeah, okay, okay, okay. that be it? No? Huh. What the? What have I not done correctly here? Hmm. Sure that's it. That would have been it. Oh, hang on a minute. Oh, hang on a second. That would then need to be this one. Because that. Oh, hang on a second. So that would need to then be. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Hold on. So that would then need to be... Oh, jeez. Hang on, let me just sort this out for a second. Bit of a fiddly one. No. Yeah, nah, e e behave. Thank you. No, whoops. Okay. Wouldn't that mean... So none of those fit. I thought I had a crack before... Oh god.
Now, if I recall correctly, there wasn't there one that fit. No. Okay. <sighs> yeah, once I can see. Is this one? Is that one there? Oh, don't tell me I wasn't at the lineup. What the hell? <sighs> There's only two combinations of this that work. That's the issue here. Unless this one somehow fits. Okay, so then, okay, well, no, 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 hang on, that can't be right, because that would mean, no. Well, if that would be the case, then that would mean that... <sighs> what the hell? How is this so damn complicated? I actually remember getting this one quite easily last time, and this one is just... This, what the actual hell? How, what? There's only two common, there's... <sighs> no, stop being an ass. Game, come on. I can't match them all up like that around each side because I, can, I can't see the whole side. I'm tempted to skip it just because we're going through so much time. This is just ridiculous. Okay, let's assume that's the case then. No, not... Okay, is there anything that matches that? Okay, there's that. Okay, so those match that, so... And unless no, because then something would have to match that one. Yeah, that's where. No, why is it going opposite ways on this one? What the? <sighs> no, that suddenly decided to go opposite. Right, so what's with this one? Is this connecting? No! I swear this lock I swear this lock game is broken because there's only two combinations that work and neither of them are working. I can't sync them all up because it doesn't work that way. What the hell's going on here? Unless it wants me to sync up the left the right Oh god, talk about bloody confusing. Right. No, stop going on. Why is it doing opposite ways with that? Okay. Let's assume it's from the right. So I can't get both to sync up. It doesn't work like that. Not that I can see anyway. Oh! That took a lot longer than it needed to. Oh, so it didn't go through as much time as I thought it did, but that's alright. <sighs> well, so, turns out it wasn't the left, it was the right. So I knew I knew there was some, I knew it couldn't fit for both sides. I just was, I just didn't realise that, oh, I'd forgotten whichever way that it could actually, um, that it needs to be on the right-hand side, so, <laughs> there you go. The Mexican company Caracao and the Chilean Barcazas both want to buy the mines. 
I need more information. Perhaps Mycroft could help. We inform you that representatives of the Barcazas, um, as his group, are granted free access from now on. This company is future owner of the mines. Also, signed from today, a no trespassing rule is upheld against any representative of the Caracal Consortium. The preliminary uh, contract of sale has been cancelled. Do not provide any explanation. This information is confidential. <clears throat> oh, that would be to talk about the, um, oh, that, oh, hang on a minute, Chesterfield. Watson. It seems that both South American companies were involved in the purchase of the mine. The man at Doncaster who fled our approach, he smokes Mexican cigars. Perhaps... Yes, Watson. We should certainly speak with him. Huh. Anything in here? No. Is, uh, is that chest? There's Ish, and let's talk to the um. Let's talk to uh, what's his name over at Evesham about the uh, other line there. I think that would be a good idea. I'll just double check that's what we need to do. <clears throat> Examine the railway branch in Evesham. So the evidence, so that was... Yes, so the e okay, Evesham, yeah, I'll ask the, uh, the trade master here. I think that's the best way to go about it. Pardon his name again. It appears that there was a small warehouse near your station, and that it was disassembled. Why is that? It was burgled overnight about two weeks ago. The police have already started their investigation, but I doubt that they'll find anything. What was inside the warehouse? Nothing of value. A few hundred feet of standby rails and some spare railway parts. But it wouldn't be easy to steal all of that. Why would anyone want to? Hmm. See you later, my good man. Okay. So that's completed. Okay. Ooh, okay. Stone railway track. Uh, <coughs> oh, excuse me. Okay, not enough information. Railway to quarry, somebody stole a rails to temporarily cover the missing section of the old railway to f flooded quarry. Somebody stole the rails to temporarily cover the missing s uh, well we're into the mines. <clears throat> I'm gonna say the mines. I mean the quad the flooded one that would take a bit longer the mines, especially if you ran the train through it. No one's looking there, be a perfect place to. Look at the mines. I'm going to say concealment. <clears throat> Train you. 
Yeah, I'm thinking concealment. Training is still inside the clap mines, yep. Cannot be sunk in the flood because the old railway leads th no, missing, yeah. Uh, let's see what, let's just see what I think would... Okay, no, so that, yeah, so that would have to be with the cannon sunk. Because that would leave, yep, okay. Let's want to see where the things might lead, okay. Okay, use telegraph. <clears throat> There's also that other thing that was the la last la... La Paz. Spoken about assault. Okay, so before we do any of that, let's. Let's go back to the carriage and look through the archives, because I believe that's what they want us to do for that. After that, we use the uh, telegraph. <coughs> yep. My search should be focused upon the name Las Zarpas. Oh, yeah, 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 okay, gotcha, gotcha, yeah. Here we are, barge transportation. The Las Zarpas, Zap, the, the, the Las Zarpas barge is a leading go heavy goods transportation. Uh, Label belongs to Mexican consortium Caracal, Caracal, Caracal. Uh, we cover shipping, electrical, s electricity services, and mining. Ha uh ha! -huh. Well, well, Here it well. Is. All right. Number tools. Yep. Okay, we need to go to Chesterfield and inquire about that. <coughs> go to Chesterfield. Use the uh, telegraph there. Is that the contract Mycroft? I asked Mycroft to find out some information on the WEA Coal Company. Here is his reply, and it is an interesting one. There, <coughs> excuse me. There are two companies: the Chilean uh, Bacas Bacasas. Uh, the, well, the Chilean one <laughs> and the Mexican one. Both wanted to purchase the WEA coal mines. The Mexican consortium has a sta had established an initial deal and had prepared all papers. However, the Chilean group, aided by their influential connections, managed to snatch the uh, the concluding deal for the mines. Okay. So this would be revenge. This would be all that revenge. Huh. Yep. No grudge. Mexicans held no grudge against Chileans' business. Business, after all. The Chileans made the train vanish in order to seal the prototype. Yeah. That's right. Well.
I don't know. No, I, 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 I'm not, I, yeah, I, we're, we're missing something. Can you get, Watson, get out of the, Watson, dude, seriously, thank you. Need to ask about the, where is the master trim? He's still in here. Yes, needs asking about. You have quite a number of dirty tools lying around here. Ah, yes. Well, thank you for reminding me. I should clean them. Although, it might be easier to put them outside. Seems it might start raining soon. I meant, what were they used for? Some workers come here and borrowed them from me. They wanted to lift the edge of the railway to one of the stations on the line, so that the water wouldn't come in too close. Oh, yeah. Who were these workers? Well, they didn't seem to be from the company, but they was fine lads. They invited me to share a drink. <laughs> and whatever it was, it had a kick to it. They wasn't English. No, I don't believe so. But see, they knew just what a man needed to brighten up his dull evening. I su I suspect a uh, I'm sniffing out a Mexican revenge plot. We just have to find him. Oh no, he'd be the other place, wouldn't he? I suspect we'll learn much from him. I, I, I smell a revenge plot from the Mexicans. That's, I really do. I don't know why, but I, it, it's can't be that simple to... Ah, cool. Please, sir, we would ask you not to leave. We have some questions. Are you the police? No, we are employed by the railway company. We are collecting witness statements about the train that disappeared last night. Lo siento, I'm in a hurry. Really? It seemed that you were waiting here for someone. Could you tell us if you were at the station last night? <laughs> no, I just arrived from South America. A formidable journey, no doubt. Which country are you from? De Chile. Hmm. Ankles. Clothes, business type. And cigar. Martial arts. Uh huh. Chile. But you are Mexican. No, you are wrong. Why would you think I'm Mexican? <laughs> uh, the uh, cigars, maybe? Because of your cigars. See, si, cigarrillos. So what? Those cigars are the Ricardo brand, from Mexico. It is quite impossible to find them anywhere but there. Pero not your business. <laughs> well then? I don't suppose that you are on vacation. What business brought you here? I was to meet my fellow compañeros. Where did you arrive yesterday? They were on that dumb train. I will stay here and hope that the authorities find them. Or their bodies. It's now my responsibility to repatriate them. Who authorized you to do that? The company I work for. 
Could you tell me the name of the company? It's not your concern. Really? And what is your name? Enough questions. When I start this. Hmm. Not a very friendly man, and he is lying. He said that he just arrived, but we know that he has been here for several days. Even that's, uh... <laughs> Okay. Yeah, this yeah next yeah held a grudge against exactly. The, I I had a sniffing suspicion like the, the, no no I'm sorry business business no way in hell it's revenge no way in hell. Oh damn right they're angry. One hundred percent. Can trap. Mm, I mean, barges cannot be sunk. Well, that doesn't really add. Well, I'm just looking at these connections here because usually they would connect up to form something. So, does that mean it could have been sunk? Oh my god. Oh, hang on a minute. So that explosive stuff would have been used for something else and not for the mine. It's a diversion. There would have been, if they take the rail away and try and sink them. So that whole little thing would have, so the whole mine stuff is like diversion. I wonder. I'm just trying to, th yeah, just, yeah, well, hang on. So, if that would be for sabotage, because that would be revenge. Cover, fl yeah, that, okay, that would make then more sense. Spite being unsure. Train pass through Chesterfield, spite being unsure of the station missed. I think they would risk it, wouldn't they? Has been sunk. Yeah. I I only I only think that that because usually all the little uh, clues have to add up s something. So Robinson, I mean to be to be fair, if he if he was in on it, then you know he was very. It, it was one of those people that you know. I mean, if he was going to make a complaint, he wouldn't stay at the train station, would he? I mean, I'm just thinking logically. I mean, I, I I mean with all the evidence we have now in front of, have in front, the victim. No, I mean, now that we have, now we know there's a whole thing, this whole revenge thing. I mean, he had the multiple contracts, which means he could have used them, put them against each other, or tried to. And, yeah, that, and if he lost it, he'd make a huge amount of money. And he was very, I mean, as, as annoyed as he was, he was picking on the young station master, wasn't he? Yeah. Uh, I... Sorry, buddy, but Chileans, Chan Quinstons. I mean, could he? Yeah, nah, they, they'll. Yeah, nah, they were left. I mean, yeah, nah, look. I'm going to stick to my original thing about the victim. Even though he was, even though he's been a crook about it, he had lost a huge amount of money, and it just, he, he, you know, he's an entrepreneur. So, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I think. Uh, I think this would be the case, but. I'll tell you what, we're going to end it right here. I know, cliffhanger. Next time, 
will be accusing the Mexicans. We're probably going to have to bring Minecraft into this to prevent a massive international incident. And I'm going to see if we're correct. And then uh, we'll be heading on to starting the next mystery. <laughs> Catch you next time.